everyone, we're on our way up to Begamafa Primary School, uh, which is up in Ndwetwe. And uh, for those of you who don't know, it's a big community here on the top end of Tombot, uh, Maidstone area. And uh, it's a gentle climb right at the top, then we drop again and then climb up again. I love the name of the school, Begamafa, uh, led by an incredible lady, Delhi, and uh, she's the principal, been a principal for three years, and uh, she's been teaching for 14 years. And, has real passion for children um, and about 160 learners, uh, seven teachers and in a really rural community so uh, just a great opportunity. Um, we obviously as Link Foundation have the privilege of partnering with Partners for Possibility and that's how this relationship started and so uh, we've been placed with uh, in a partnership or relationship with Delhi and um, Think around Partners for Possibility, it's an organization that was started by a lady by the name of Louise in Cape Town and uh, she really, her vision was to really make an impact uh, for children in the education system and as you know Link Foundation, are, one of our thrusts is to um, look at ways of helping the education system um, and uh, so with Partners for Possibility they really believe in reaching a community through schools and uh, if you think about it, your local school, a principal um, has an influence over her teachers, over the parents and over the pupils and uh, really believe that's an important cog in our society and so uh, that relationship has started. We've been going for about three months now, um, just meeting up, uh, we're doing some training together and so I'm going to be on the journey just this morning just to capture some of the heart of the school and the pupils and see a little bit about the infrastructure resource but more importantly um, get to see something we haven't seen before and learn. I think one of the wonderful things about Partners for Possibility and this relationship and our foundation is that we always want to be learning, growing, improving and so I think uh, we've got so much to learn about what happens in South Africa, what happens in our rural communities, what happens in our schools. We are out here at Bega Marfa, just arrived, and uh, what I love about it is it's pretty high up. Uh, as the word says, Bega Marfa is look after inheritance, but I felt like we Bega Marfa, you're in the clouds. But uh, it's in a deep rural KwaZulu Natal, about 20 k's this side of Ntwetwe towards Ananda, and so this is rural KZN. And so we, uh, we are partners with the school, it's an amazing school, as you can see, and you'll see just now some great resource in a rural area. Um, but some incredible stories. Love Delhi, her heart for the school. You can hear some children in the background. They're learning, they're in their classes now. And uh, so we're gonna take a little journey around the school, show you a little bit of what's going on. Uh, but what I love about Partners for Possibility is they always believe in the impossible, that nothing is impossible. And we believe that for our education system. And love the fact that this community are taking responsibility for their school. And uh, so we're encouraged by that. We have so much to learn from this journey too. Come, let's walk around, have a look. about the school Begum Alpha and our journey with Partners for Possibility is this thought that South Africa is alive with possibility. And I love the fact that as we partner with uh, the school that I've, we formed a friendship with Delhi, a principal that we believe could impact this community. And so I got to meet an incredible person, a person that has a heart for this community, the school, and loves her teachers, loves these pupils. And in a very rural space, we've seen incredible resource. And so, uh, so encouraged by that. Also encouraged by stories, stories of possibility. And just one is Matembi, she's a, a local lady that is working now in the kitchen, but met her a couple of weeks ago, or months ago, actually she was working in the garden here. And uh, she put her hand up to volunteer last year, part of the community but getting involved, and started a veggie garden. And now she's been employed and full-time, got two children in the school. And I love this because Partners for Possibility is all around a community taking responsibility for the school. And so this is just one story or one story of transformation. I wonder what it looked like at the back end of this year. We would see transformation throughout 
uh, not just the school, but community. Um, and just love this thought that, you know what, this is just the beginning, we're journeying together. And um, I love the thought that Partners for Possibility is giving us an opportunity to learn. As I said earlier, we think that we arrive at a place where we have, we have something to give, but actually in it, we've learned so much. And I really believe that this is the heart behind uh, Partners for Possibility.